I see in the past someone clearly made a decision. All right, the Queen of Swords in reverse here. I feel that um, we have the Ace of Swords as the overall energy here. So. There, were, there could have been some harsh communication or there could have been some truth or there could have been some kind of realization that came out, okay? Ace of Swords can be cutting through some bullshit or just cutting through uh, some, uh, cutting someone out of your life, which I feel with the Two of Swords in the past happened. Someone was indecisive for a very long time. They couldn't make up their mind and they were, they were refusing to make a decision. But in the past, I feel they finally made a decision. And with the coming into the current situation with the Queen of Swords in reverse here, I think you cut someone out or someone cut you out, Libra. And now someone's very, very bitter and vengeful. Someone's very angry and pissed off, okay? This person, they have a very sharp tongue, okay? So they'll tell you with their words how pissed off they are. Someone's very vengeful. Right now with the Nine of Swords here, if you've cut this person out, someone's freaking out, okay? I think there's, they're in panic mode right now. And with the Ace of Pentacles is how they view you is they feel that now you want a brand new beginning with them. You want a practical beginning with them. You want a commitment, okay? Feel free to switch the energies like I said, guys. Maybe you are wanting this or you want them to give you this commitment. However, take it how it resonates. In their deepest emotions with the strength of reverse, I feel they feel that you've thrown up. They've thrown up their hands up in the air. They've thrown their hands up in the air. They have given up. They don't have the courage. They can't fight this anymore, okay? They could have been holding back for a very long time, okay? But now they feel they're unable to tame the situation. They're lacking confidence and they're growing impatient, okay? This could be someone just saying, fuck it, all right? Like someone's just having a hard time, you know, taming their behavior or the situation. Someone could have been tired of dealing with a situation, all right? They're doubting themselves. They're lacking the inner strength. How do they move, want to move forward with you with the King of Cups in reverse here? Right now, they're shutting down emotionally, okay? Someone's emotionally unavailable. With the King of Wands in reverse here, this is what's going on in the background or this is the blockages. Someone's just not being serious, okay? They're acting too cool. They're not taking things seriously. They're not taking action. But I think this is just a show. They're just putting up a show because with the Nine of Swords here, we already know they're panicking, right? Someone's panicking. They're, they're, they're in panic mode. They're, they're overthinking the situation. They can't think. They can't stop thinking. You're on their mind 24-7. Your advice is the Queen of Pentacles. Probably it's asking you to stay in your power and asking you to just know your worth. Okay, know your worth, know your self-esteem. Focus on uh, your money. Focus on yourself. Focus on your life and focus on your stability and security. That's her advice. With the Seven of Pentacles here as the likely outcome, I feel you guys are still going to be waiting. Okay, there's going to be a waiting game. Someone's still thinking about whether they want to invest into this situation anymore or not because they're waiting for their fruits of labor. Alright, what happened in the past? Why is the Two of Swords in reverse here? Why is the Two of Swords in reverse here? Someone made a decision with the Ace of Cups in reverse here. They chose to shut down. Okay, someone could have shut down emotionally. Someone does not want a reconciliation. Or someone just stopped offering their cup of love. Okay, the Ace of Cups in reverse is someone just shutting down emotionally. Why the Ace of Cups in reverse? Yeah, because someone wanted to be single. I think someone just... Prop either someone realized their worth and value. And they wanted to be single and they, they're, they're just shutting their emotions towards you. Or someone just is shut down emotionally and they don't want to be in this relationship very, anymore. They could have been very indecisive for a very long time. But yeah, now they're choosing to be single. They're choosing their... This is someone who wants to be sing, who's single, independent, who knows their worth, self-esteem, a lot like that. Okay. Why is the Queen of Swords in reverse here in the current situation? Why is the Queen of Swords in reverse? Why is the Queen of Swords in reverse? Yeah, someone's lost patience, someone's lacking balance, someone's just not being able to handle and tackle the situation. It's falling right there. The strength and reverse is also again. It's the same thing. Someone's just not being able to digest. I think the decision that was made, right? Someone's not being able to digest that someone just cut the other person off. Libra, if you cut this person off, the other person is not being able to handle it. With the temperance and reverse, they're just overindulging into alcohol there's a lack of balance this is someone who's going batshit crazy okay they just do not know how to handle the situation they're going out of control 
Why the temperance in reverse? This is someone who doesn't want to compromise, no, not cooperate. They're just going crazy. Why for the temperance in reverse? I think this could also be someone you cut someone off and you cut some you cut them off because you don't want a reconciliation with them. It could also be that you don't want reconciliation. You don't want to come to any peaceful resolution with this person. You're just more like with the Queen of Salt and Reverse. You're just like fuck you, fuck your dad, fuck your mom, fuck your family, fuck your dog. It's like that. Life of the Temperance in Reverse. Oh yes, sometimes I have a bad mouth. If it offends you, hard luck, guys. Life of the Temperance in Reverse. They do know. Probably there was someone here who had to make a difficult choice. If not, someone wants a reunion with the lovers here. Could be dealing with a Gemini. But someone wants a reunion here. This is someone who feels a very strong soulmate connection. And they're very, very hurt because you cut them off. But they feel the connection and they want a reunion. Someone wants to come back together after you cut them off in the past. Clap for the Nine of Swords. Why is the Nine of Swords on this person's mind? Why is the Nine of Swords on this person's mind? They're freaking out. They're emotion this is someone who's very emotionally dependent, okay? This person cannot be happy on their own. This is someone who needs someone else to make them happy. Alright? They're very, very emotionally unfulfilled right now. Clap for the ace of pentacles. Why does Lib why does uh, Libra's person view Libra as the ace of pentacles? Why do they view you as the ace of pentacles? Yeah, but they're not being able to manifest it. So someone is viewing you as you want a commitment. You want a brand new beginning. But with the magician in reverse, someone views the other person as highly manipulative. Okay, this is not someone with good intentions. They think you're manipulating them again like you did before. Okay, and uh, or it could also be that this person wants you use, views you as wanting a commitment. But with the magician in reverse, they feel very powerless of the situation and there's a lack of action. Okay. Someone's doubting this. This is a lot of self-doubt because someone's doubting if this is going to work out or not. That's why probably uh, they're not being able to get the commitment. Someone doesn't feel they're going to be able to manifest this relationship. Why is the strength in reverse? Why is the strength in reverse in this person's emotions for Libra? Why is the strength in reverse? Yeah, because you guys are just not being able to come together with the three of pentacles in reverse. There's a lack of collaboration. There's a lack of teamwork. Okay, this is a one-sided situation. Just one person is putting in all the effort. Only one person is putting in all um, um, their emotions. They're doing everything in the relationship, but they're just—it's like it just doesn't reach a point where there's any appreciation, or there's just like two people not on the same page. Okay. Also, the three of pentacles in reverse is a third party situation. There could be a third party involved in this or a third element that is coming between you guys. But I'm not feeling it too much. All right. But with the strength in reverse, they just feel, you know what? I'm done. I don't think this is happening. Like, screw this. Okay. We're just never going to be able to be on the same page. That's what's in their emotions. Give me one more card for three of pentacles in reverse. Why the three of pentacles in reverse? Yeah, because someone's constantly procrastinating. There's a lack of communication here with the Page of Pentacles in reverse. I think the way this person is approaching the situation is wrong. I think the approach is wrong with the Page of Pentacles in reverse here. They're wanting to communicate, but probably the way they're trying to communicate is a very loserish attitude. Or they're probably feeling like they're procrastinating. Should I? Should I not? They're not even approaching the situation. Why? Because they're doubting this with the, with the Magician in reverse. Okay? Feel free to switch the energies, guys. I say it like a hundred times. So this could be you. This could be them. Okay. So, but I'm going to read it out. Read it out as a Libra. As I'm doing Libra's reading. Okay. All right. There is a lack of communication. There is a lack of stability that is offered. Okay. Someone's not being able to offer the stability, security, and commitment. Okay. There's a lack of commitment here. Lack of something solid and stable. I feel it's someone who's procrastinating all the time. Like, yeah, I'll do it. But they don't. Or say, yeah, I'll do this, I'll do this, I'll do this also, but they just land up knowing nothing. Or this is just someone who's approaching the situation. Their approach is absolutely wrong. Try for the King of Cups in reverse. Try for the King of Cups in reverse. Someone's not doing their homework. They're just approaching the situation randomly, okay? Try for the King of Cups in reverse. Let's see. They want to move forward with you. They want this commitment with you. The Empress, they want a brand new beginning with you. They realize your worth. I see a lot 
of realizing their worth, okay? So I think when you cut this person off and when the, we already have the nine of pentacles here in the past, someone realizes the worth and value of a connection or of a person, okay? The empress is someone who can take care of her shit. She takes care of her life. She knows how to take care of her business. She's like an entire package, okay? The empress is also a mother. You could be dealing with a mother. doesn't have to be. But this is just someone who knows, I mean, um, she knows how to take care of her shit, okay? So I feel with the Empress here, they want everything with you, okay? This is someone who wants a commitment and this is who wants growth, expansion. They want to nurture the connection because they realize that, you know, you can do it every, you, you do, you can do all, you can do it all by yourself. You don't need anybody, okay? This is someone, this is abundance, okay? This is what they want. This is how they want to move forward with you. And with the Ten of Pentacles here, they want marriage, they want commitment, they want the family, they want the kids, they want the dogs, everything, okay? But... Right now, they're putting up a show with the King of Cups in reverse. They emotionally shut down. And like I said, what you don't know is in the background with the King of Wands in reverse here. They're acting very cool. They're acting like they're not serious and stuff. But look, they're hiding their emotions. And with your, what's on their mind with the Nine of Swords here, they're freaking out. They cannot stop thinking about you. But they want commitment and they want growth and expansion with you. Okay? This is definitely... I mean, the two of cups and divorce just fell out. There is a disconnection between you guys. You could have broken up, separation, but they want all this. They're just putting up a show. Clap for the king of wands in reverse. Clap for the king of wands in reverse. Yep. What did I just say? They're keeping quiet. They're keeping extremely quiet about their moves. The, the, the high priestess is a secret keeper, okay? She, she's... She knows more than she says. So this person is going to keep it very quiet. Okay. It could also be that... No, it can't be. But the thing I was going to say that it could also be that you know everything. But this is what's going on in the background. This is what you don't know. This is what's in the hidden factor. Okay. So yes, they're not taking action. They're acting and playing it very cool. But with the high priestess here, they're keeping their moves very, very quiet. Okay. They're not talking too much. Either you're giving them the silent treatment or they're giving you the silent treatment. Okay. But this person knows everything. Okay. They know the kind of approach they need to make towards you. So with the high priestess here, I feel that, you know, if they're not taking action, probably they're holding back for a reason. And with the high priestess here, they're trusting their intuition, okay? Their intuition is quite on point. Clap for the high priestess. Clap for the high priestess. Yeah. With the Wheel of Fortune in reverse here, probably they feel that things are not going their way right now. And that's why they need to hold back and they're going to open up at the right time. Why is the Queen of Pentacles here as advice for Libra? Why is the Queen of Pentacles as advice for Libra? Why is the Queen of Pentacles as advice for Libra? Yeah. So they're saying invest in yourself. Okay. Learn to know what you deserve and invest in yourself. I don't see this as saying that, you know, like... Um, it's more like, you know, know your self-worth and value, okay? This is this is someone who is very stable, someone who is very stable and secure in all areas of life, okay? This is all about potential. But this is someone who needs to focus on their overall stability and growth, okay? This is focus on your money, focus on everything that gives you stability and foundation, focus on your career, etc. And with the Seven of Cups here, I feel that it's asking you to keep your options open, Why the Seven of Cups? Why the Seven of Cups? Keep your options open. Keep an open mind. Yeah. They're saying keep an open mind. And with the Four of Pentacles here, I feel they're asking you to hold back for a while. Pretty much. Yeah. I get the intuition. They're asking you to hold back for a while. Focus on yourself and keep an open mind. Okay. Why have the Seven of Pentacles? Why is the seven of why is the seven of pentacles here as the likely outcome? Why for the seven of pentacles? Whoa, whoa, whoa! Too many cards. Too many cards. I'll take this. The likely outcome is someone's going to wait and watch. While you're waiting and watching, I guess someone's going to rush in with the knight of swords. Someone wants to communicate, or someone just wants to start an argument. Okay. Yeah, for the knight of swords. This is someone who has a lot to say. Yeah, for the knight of swords, but they're not going to be the best. They're not going to be the sweetest people, okay? This is someone who's coming in, coming in to stir down a conflict, okay? Knight of Swords is rushing in, okay? They're going to come in, they're going to say something, and they're going to leave, okay? They're, it's more like they were just going to come in to say what they have to say for a very long time if they've been holding back, and they're just going to come in, they're going to say what they have to, and they're going to leave. 
Fly for the Knight of Swords. That's a lot of argument. Fly for the Knight of Swords. See? This is someone who's trying to get over um, backstabbing, betrayal, or hurt. Okay? Someone's trying to get over it. And probably, probably you're waiting and watching. And while you're waiting and watching, or this is someone who's waiting and watching if they want to invest or not. But someone's getting over, someone felt backstabbed and betrayed, and now there's someone who's trying to get over this entire situation, get over the entire painful cycle, you know. Yeah. Clap for the Ace of Swords, I forgot to uh, clap for the overall energy. Why is the Ace of Swords here as the overall energy for Libra? Why is the Ace of Swords here as the overall energy for Libra? See, there was some communication, you cut someone off, and with the Four of Swords here, you're taking a break. Definitely lack of communication. Four of Swords is dead silent. Okay, no one's talking. No one's saying anything. But yes, with the Ace of Swords here, I think you definitely cut this person off. Where for the Four of Swords? See? You're in your power, babe. Babe, dude, whoever. But it's the Queen of Wands. Doesn't matter. But, um, someone's in their power. Someone realizes. You know what? I feel Libra out here. I get a lot of someone realizes their worth, someone realizes their value, someone's protecting their self-esteem, someone realizes that they deserve much more and they weren't getting it and they just kept giving and giving and giving and the opposite person did shit, okay? Now I feel this is someone who's taking action, okay? This is someone who's, um, they've got passion, they're very confident and they've got that go for a pipe, okay? So someone's watching you after you cut them off and with that no with, with that no contact method that you're doing, someone realizes your value, someone sees your worth, someone watches you as an action taker. They, 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 they see you having your shit together. Like, because they see you like this, right? Now, they want the Ten of Pentacles. They want the commitment. They want the growth and expansion. They also view you as wanting the same thing, but with the magician in reverse, they feel that you probably um, think they're manipulative. Or they feel you're manipulating the situation. Could be anything. Libra, let me know how this video resonates. Leave your comments below and please like, share, subscribe and let me know. Alright.